restaurant, Chapino has it all. You can find seafood, steak, and a killer brunch. Joining me in the kitchen is general manager Dana Zinzer and executive chef Robert Carter, also known as RC. Hello. Thank you guys for coming in. Thanks for having us. Thanks, thanks Heather. And so we actually have your namesake right here. Yes. Tell us what the, about the dish. So the nice part about Chapino, a lot of people think the restaurant is Italian because of the name, but right. it's actually our signature dish, which comes from San Francisco. So it's a seafood dish. Uh, a lot of times it's, you know, kind of made all together, but our chefs take time, individually cook every piece of fish, every piece of seafood on there, and then the broth that's in the pour at the restaurant, we bring it out, we actually pour at the table, please, and by all do means. Do I pour it all over? Oh, yeah. yeah it's all the good stuff. So wow. there's fennel in there, there's onion in there, it's a tomato base, um, and it is fabulous. The chefs take a lot of time and uh, care to make that broth, too. Look at that. And it smells wonderful. <laughs> yeah. And what do we have here on so the then, stove going? So then um, we have a so we make a layer. There's layered potatoes. There's a lot of lot of lot of butter. Lot of lot of slicing. I, I'm hand not slicing, mad at it. And then and then after after it's baked and chilled, we uh, we we deep fry it. So you got potatoes that are cooked in butter and then deep fried, uh, served with the uh, new. You didn't have to tell us all that. <laughs> yeah. You could have just said it's you're a, amazing. It's, it's, it's a labor. <laughs> it's a labor of love. We we make we make. 99% of everything in the house, we don't uh, um, we don't buy, any, buy anything that's not um, we don't use anything that's not uh, made uh, by made, their hands. made in in the restaurant. So, and how, where, how do you come up with with the menu? Um, it's basically what we're excited about at the same at, at that time. Yeah. Um, uh, I'm a mushroom guy. I have a mushroom connection. We always have uh, the, the the fresh produce and 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 then whatever is seasonal. Okay, well, can I try the butter deep fried potato? <laughs> yeah, yeah, please, please do, please do. Those potatoes are okay. This looks amazing. So that is one thing that our chefs always focus on is <laughs> local purveyors. Everything we get in house is from either the Strip or somewhere around Pittsburgh, and they take a lot of pride in that. So we are a local restaurant. We use everything local. We really do try to stay Pittsburgh based for sure. This looks so good. There's uh, thyme, rosemary, and garlic uh, in, infusing the butter in the potatoes. <laughs> um, we we are a wow. seafood steakhouse with a potato problem. <laughs> with a potato problem. We, we, we enjoy potatoes a lot. Well, I hear you also like waffles a lot. And we, so this a, it's a yeast it's a yeast raised Belgian waffle dough with with pearl sugar. It's not it's not regular quick bread. Um, we have a Pennsylvania maple syrup, fresh fruit. Uh, bacon, candy, candy nuts, and everyone loves Nutella with their waffles. Um, is this a shareable plate or is this a personal serving? I've seen someone <laughs> take the whole thing down by themselves. Well, that might be me. <laughs> I could definitely handle this whole thing, especially the pile of bacon in the corner. <laughs> yes. It looks amazing. So what else do you guys do at Chipino? So Chef RC not only does a waffle board like this where it's kind of your standard Jeez, waffle so board where it has a lot more of your sweets, your maple and things like that, but they also do a lox board as well. So it'll be a waffle potato. They do a little bit of uh, <laughs> salmon lox on there as well. Um, and then they just added a brand new, after the Taylor Swift concert, we added a brand new um, chicken and waffles. So we make the chicken in house. He does a spicy mayo and a spicy soy sauce with it. And then it has our leisure waffles on it as well. So we have multiple different kinds of waffle boards. So we have a little waffle for everyone. Even if you don't like sweet, we do a little savory, we do a little bit of it all. So he's very creative with that. And our brunch menu changes seasonally as well, making sure we stay up with the freshest stuff we possibly can in this strip. I don't even know what to do with my body. <laughs> what is this delicious, so is it the, like a cherry sauce? So there's, there's, a, there's a sherry reduction and the uh, demi glass. We take bones and make, and we don't, we don't there's, nothing, there's nothing out of a can, out of a, out of a refrigerator. It's amazing. So yeah, so everything, everything we make, uh, we take the time to make a lot of stuff. In, that, that a, lot of, a lot of restaurants don't do anymore. Wow, and I know we, we talked about local ingredients and the care taken in putting together some of your meals, including the Chipino, but what, what is all in this if people are gonna order this? So there's, uh, so we, we, we rotate the fish uh, with, that's in the, in the Chipino. Mm -hmm. Right now there's halibut. Um, there's always clams, mussels, lobster, um, and, and shrimp. Um, we, we buy a, uh, U12. It's a, it's not a it's not a gigantic one, but it's not a small shrimp uh, at all. Um, it looks beautiful. Always then, have grilled breads. So you can soak yeah, up the, the grill, good stuff. Grill, oh grill, yeah, grilled <laughs> sourdough. Um, and then um, 
the lobsters out of the shell so you don't have to deal with you don't have to deal with that perfect <laughs> and dana where can people find you so we're in the strip district we're right across from the old cork factory so we're in the corner of 23rd and railroad on the weekends we do valet complimentary valet on the weekends we do have garage parking because the strip can be a struggle to park in Absolutely. so we always try to make it as convenient as possible and then you can take a nice walk to the river right after seeing us rc i'm coming to see you not only for this lamb dish but i'm getting my hands on those waffles thank so, you so, so much so brunch is 11 to 2 on saturdays Absolutely. Absolutely. You'll see you there sometime soon.